All right, welcome back. We're gonna. I'm gonna get my ass handed to me by this. Welcome back to Franklin. Luckily, luckily there is a sniper rifle over here. I think. Hmm. Well. Nope. There's not. Yeah, there is. Oh, dragon sniper. Wait. Oh, okay. So there's no hip firing from this thing. <laughs> <sighs> you were behind cover and you got like fucking smoked. That's yes, funny. I saw. I noticed, Mikey. Oh. He was there. I was there. He witnessed it. He lived it. Mm. See. Ugh, these it, guys just jump from the cover. The boomstick just does it. Oh. In their mind, that's stand corrected. So, Alonzo, what have you been doing lately? Why is it not shooting? So lots of fart, uh, football. Fart ball. Oh, fart ball. I was about to say it because Ethan's here. A lot of football <laughs> and just classes and surviving and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely surviving. That's definitely the hard part. Yeah. Oh, hey, you, you got him from behind the thing. Remember how, like, in the last session, you were just like, Oh, so when I'm behind the thing, I can get really easily. Well, it's because I could, I could hit his his knees this time. Where usually there's, it's like the whole thing is like completely mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. borked. Uh huh. Come on. Gosh, it's like you gotta think about how much all the shit costs that they're lugging down here, like all these guns, and it's just like, oh yeah, well when we find this ancient treasure, it'll be totally worth it. Yeah. What are you talking about? That was there. That is an ancient gun turret. Don't you know? They used those up back in the Wait. 1300s. And oh everything. yeah, Sir Francis Drake was a master engineer. Yeah. Well, my favorite, my favorite is Uncharted 2, where it's like you, you're like the second person, you're like the first person to sneak in here, in, in like the ancient Shambhala, and all of a sudden there are like turrets everywhere. Like, where did they all come from? Like, you, they didn't sneak in before you. That's the or like, or it's like you have to climb precariously across like a giant ledge. Aliens. And then like, and then like on the other side, there's just like. There's just like their entire base camp with trucks and everything. It's like, how did it get there? Aliens. I love that. I love that part. Where like, um, right when you're about to get into Shambhal, yeah, like Shangri-La or whatever it was. Shambhal or bo both. Um, where like, where like Flynn is like esco escorting you inside, and then they're like just trading white Rai quips with each other the whole time as they're climbing around. Oh yeah, looks like your mom. <laughs> look how fast. Look how far they're flying. Mm. Like the, Fly like an eagle. I, I'm going to run up there and they're going to kill me. High. You know, I edited a Kirby episode today, Ethan. No, you, you did another your, your, your Mama joke. You were just like, oh, your mom's easier with two or three. Your mom is like a doorknob. Everyone gets a turn. <laughs> Are you okay? What? Do you like my uh, stocking anarchy? It's all right. It's not bad. It's basically the opposite of a uh, of a uh, avatar and all that. It's Japan. With yeah, I know. It, it's inspiration. like inspiration. I know. We have to watch that show. It's so good. Reminds me a lot of Powerpuff Girls. You guys should see the look at It's not like bad yeah, Girls I know. at all. I've seen some uh, some uh, funny uh, gifs of it. Oh, it's so great. You guys should watch Korra as well. I've seen the first two seasons and they were really good. No, they're not. Spoiler. Oh, hey, end. that guy. Mm. Well, I know what happens at the ending. I got that spoiled. Hey, shut up. No, I was I don't saying know. Don't the talk show about ends. It. The show ends after it starts. Oh. Yeah. Is that Mikey I around that guess. corner there? What? Oh, Mikey. I it's got somebody him. trying to sell them. Wait, how, how does it go in SpongeBob? Is somebody there trying, trying to, to sell me something? <laughs> 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 it's like he walks away. I knew he, I told you he was onto us. I saw that body. I thought it was Sully for some reason. Cause Sully's dead, don't you know? I realized <laughs> oh, yeah, that. He's I realized totally dead. they play that. They play that Sully's dead card twice in this series. The yeah, one. the second times in the um, the third other one. game. I know the third one. Oh, shut up! Just sh shut up, guys. Shut up. Quiet. We're trying to watch a cutscene. How did you get here? You really need to see this. Now is really not the best time. No, Nate. What are you doing? You really need to watch this. It's just... What? Don't look at the stuff on the dock. And... Hello. He's alive. Huh. I don't know, Nate. I mean... How much do you trust this guy? It's not exactly like they're holding them at gunpoint. I, I know. We got to get the hell out of here. Yeah, it seems weird. But no, 
Sully's a lot of things, but he's not a backstabber. Which way were they headed? Uh, northish. Yeah, towards the mountains. Okay, it's gotta be the monastery. <sighs> Let's go. Uh, what if it turns out he's working with them? We either rescue him, or we beat the crap out of him. Hell, I might just beat the crap out of him anyway. And if you follow those three easy steps, you too can be a millionaire. Wow. So, Alonzo, if that's the case, how come you haven't followed those own three steps? Well, because if I did... Well, I'm not a licensed... There wouldn't be no point in life, man. But I'd I'd, I'm not a licensed mortician, uh, so Alonzo I can't. Alonzo forgot to wash his hands. Shit. <laughs> Okay, oh, by the way, Sully's alive. We just saw that. Yeah, speaking of... What? Oh, what? 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 oh, they're shooting M79s. I thought they were throwing grenades at me. This is like my favorite... No, wait. My favorite gun in the whole game, in the whole series is probably the Desert 5 or the Mag 5 from the second game and the third game, respectively. I like the boomstick. Those guns just go... and shoot everything, kill everything in one shot. Even though there are several guns that do that. What? What? Where do you guys... We, we've all played Uncharted 3 at this point, right? Yes. yes. Do, we, do we have more or less the same sort of feeling about it? Yeah. What What is What is your... What is said feeling? Like that the second one was better and that by the time they got to the third one, all the tropes were starting to wear thin. Not, yeah. exa not exactly, because I, I just played it again this week and I realized it is better than I thought it was, but I, I don't... It, there's something about it that just feels empty. Yeah, about the it's, it's the, the story. third game in a series. That's it, what it it's felt the, like. It's the story, and hold on, mm. there's another cutscene here. We have to shut up for. How does something like this happen? See those scorch marks? Uh huh. Somebody packed this place with enough gunpowder to blow it wide open. Ooh. Watch where you step. Some of these boards are really falling. <laughs> Charlie Shot Cutter. Yeah, was he in the second game? No, he was only in the third game. Okay. Like the first half it's of like, it. like, Elena acted like she knew him in the third game. Yeah, she did. Oh, well, we're, we kind of mentioned part of the third game. You didn't. You guys didn't miss anything in that cutscene. Yeah. Um, what were we talking about before that? Uncharted oh, 3. Uncharted 3. If we yeah. liked it or yeah, not. Yeah, I, I really like Uncharted 3 a lot. It's... I mean, it was, I mean, it was still good, a good yeah. game. Holy God, your burps smell like... Rotting entrails. They smell like rotten enchiladas. <laughs> we went over the tortillas. Tortillas. Oh, it's I pronounced don't... Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. The yes. stealth is broken in this game. You kill one person, and then they all notice where you're at. Mm. Except, yeah, hey, except yeah, this time. It's a little harder <laughs> when you can't hear, when you can't hear the TV. You know. Yeah, a little bit. He's gonna kill you. No, yeah, Unch Uncharted Three, good game. Um, good game. Except they, they change, they change up like Sully and Nate's character uh, the relationship. Here it just seems like they're pals, and that one they like really stress that Sully's a mentor and like a father figure. Like yeah, father figure to him. And this one, this one, it's like the, he wasn't even sad when he died. When they, when they thought yeah, he died. I liked it better that in Three, the way they did it there. Yeah, I don't mind it. I like it. I like you. Right. Yeah, no, yeah. So that was a short chapter. <laughs> oh, wait, I suppose that was like nine minutes. But yeah, that was, was like long as the last. Uh, look at the pop in on that text ring right there. It's still not popping. Yeah. In. Oh my god. Oh shit. <laughs> and off. Wait, that's the wrong way. <laughs> it looked right to me. <laughs> I like how you made room noises with your mouth just now. <laughs> To me, the point where I sort of felt like, yeah, I really thought the second one was better was the, the ship 
the cruise ship part. Yeah, like the third one. See, yeah, I like how I control Lena in, in this part. Mm. What is she doing? She's, She's not patting him on the back. Um. Oh shoot. Yeah, those can blow up. Um. Yeah. Uh, the gra well, the graphics in the third game are excellent, just like the second one. But like, I think the 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 color theme in the second one's better too, so it's more pleasing to look at. Like the busy cities, versus the third game where everything is brown. Yeah. Kind where of the second one is like beautiful, like blue and white mountain tops, for like half mm -hmm. the game. It's a just little like that bit. cruise ship, like between that, that level is stupid. Between like, like how long cool. it fucking took yeah. to get on thing. Yeah. Well, I didn't like you have to go through the ship graveyard for like three hours, and then you actually get to the ship itself. Yeah. Then it like tilts sideways, and you gotta escape. Yeah, that now that was, was cool. stupid. I thought the tilting side was kind of. Cool. I mean, I mean, I it was cool, but like, but yeah, you know, it, 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 it was fast. cool. It was cool, but it's like there's not a chance that one single grenade would sink a giant ship like that. There's no chance because they've got water. Do you want to test it out? They've got water heads. They've got watertight <laughs> compartments. Yeah, we'll, we'll do. We'll make Ocean's 14 right now with the real ocean. Yeah, they've got watertight compartments that prevent something like a single hole from sinking a ship like that. That's what they learned from Titanic. Yes. Did you see John Chan's new episode of no, Titanic? Didn't Titanic yes. have multiple Titanic. holes, Ethan? What? What? Didn't what? Titanic? The Titanic have multiple holes, but the no. iceberg punctured all of them. Uh, what happened was it was kind of in a time where they were experimenting with that. There were 16 waterhead compartments. Um, if the first four were punctured, then the ship would survive because they had them all sealed off at the top. But after that, they're like, oh, there won't be any hole that takes up more than four waterhead compartments, so we'll just not seal them at the top. And no only have them, only have them, like, go a certain way, you know? Oh, join us next time. We'll finish that story. 